every emotion is made of love so whatever emotion is it it's all essentially like white light of love it spreads into seven colors of emotions if you reject any one emotion any one color you cannot experience the white light that's why we find it difficult to experience the divinity in us because we are rejecting our colors and once you accept all the dimensions without judging without grabbing without rejecting next step will be you will become aware that you are the light which is radiating the seven dimensions so that is the point of hare ram hare krishna ram is like sunlight krishna is like seven colors of that light and that is a participation of that light into life that's what krishna represent look at his life he was uh, doing romance taking care of cows stealing butter flirting then he became a yogi also then he played politics also got married and played politics killed people with deception and even made mahabharat happen means the functioning the multiple creative diversity of our being of ram is krishna so in scriptures they are saying that uh, krishan rupaya shri ram you know so they are not separate when you say hare ram hare krishna means you are saying sunlight and its rainbow ram is of no point if there is no drama happening on the earth of seven colors you know so what you will do alone in white light you know so so that is the point so converging so that's why chaitanya mahaprabhu made from the original mantra was hare ram hare krishna originally in the upanishad but chaitanya mahaprabhu made it hare krishna hare rama because we are trapped into krishna we are lost into that game so our solution is coming back to ram but in olden times people were into ram they were to be inspired to go into krishna to expand the prism you expand out but here to understand the secret of krishna is you always know yourself as light then you will not get trapped into any of the colors if you look at today's problem everybody is trapped into some color and everybody is rejecting one color of the rainbow people who are with sexuality they are attached to the red color people who are into meditation they are attached to the blue color they think red is wrong they think blue is wrong but what is the balance wisdom that they all belong to one ram one light so how you can reject so who are you to choose life has formed all this why you are making choices that is the intelligent question to ask you don't make choices you participate as it comes before you you don't fantasize about it you don't miss it you just function with what is there then you will understand what krishna is krishna was not attached with any of his characters krishna means attraction even look at the word krishna the root of the tongue the muladhara sh the fire na the movement so from earth till sky it's krishna whereas yogi is trying to reach the sky so it needs a deep wisdom to accept your materiality and spirituality in one breath then you will become kind of mystery to your other friends because he he's what he's spiritual or material and such people lose even their so called morals because then they when there is a fight they will slap you and you will see them doing a bhajan also this is how this person can do that but that is the quality you reflect what is happening in front of you you don't choose ideals and say oh i believe into non violence and that's what happened to india it started to believe in non violence and it was invaded for centuries and destroyed 2 3000 years before nobody would dare to attack india we were spiritually rich as well as we were much we knew how to defend ourselves and today we need that we need krishna in us rama in us krishna who creates and celebrates rama who can fight and you know who's martial it's about a character how that light will behave but krishna is called puran avatara because he did not say no to anything of the life which is offering but we are saying no to many things grabbing many things but krishna said yes to every character within and that need got some by the way you will have lots of opposition i had just by two women two three days back what crap you are sitting you are talking you are making this followers and they are all, 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 all. and they really because people when they this is the problem as being a teacher like me because which i don't call myself guru or anything i am touching every aspect from sexuality to wealth because as a part of one life 
and it freaks people out. Not only that, they are freaked out by the people around has so much love for me, that freaks them out more. Because they feel that this is kind of too much, you know, this guy must be doing some hypnosis or something. But they don't understand that I am talking to the humans, not to my disciples, not to my any, my products of. Its human need is varied into each human. You can't have a generalized path on people. So Ram and Krishna are very balanced. Ram is more like a yogi, Sappar Ram Tapasvi Raja. And Krishna is more like out in the field, in the streets, playing the games, you know. So if you can have these both aspects, you will feel that you are becoming richer. Shri Ram